Pantry, and today I'm going to bring you along for a delicious summertime treat at our house. Um, we love to have fish whenever possible, but um, you know, it's, it's, it's once or twice a week, and uh, it's grilling season, so we're going to have grilled trout with a simple mango salsa that just takes this over the top and makes it delicious. So I hope it brings you along. I hope you check out the description box below and I've got links down there for you to do a little shopping if you want, but I've also got a link to uh, my Facebook page. You can go over and say hi and see what's going on over there and join in on the conversation, as well as my mailing address and my Zacon Fresh Foods link. That is where you can go sign up for free and uh, take advantage of discount bulk meats um, that are just top quality. So I hope you go check it out and uh, stay for the video. All right, so we've got uh, half of a white onion and those are a little sweeter. I've got uh, the zest of one lime in here and I'm gonna juice this lime as well. And I've got a little bunch, my first picking of cilantro out of the garden. Um, so I've got that and I've got a mango here I'm gonna cut up as well as, and that's a nice juicy lime. Made my mouth water. So go ahead and juice that lime. Um, this little gadget right here is a must have in the kitchen. I just love that thing. I'm going to go ahead and put my cilantro and my onion in here. And then we're going to add mango and a little bit of tomato. And the tomato, kind of savory tomato flavor with the sweet mango, it just goes fantastic together. And I love the onion, so. We're going to go ahead and stir that. And while this sits in the refrigerator, then we'll get our trout. So I'm bringing you back to let you know what I've, all I've done. I did salt and pepper. I also grated up a pretty large clove of garlic. Just grated it on the grater, just like I did the zest. And then I went out and picked a couple peppers. I have a kind of small jalapeno that I seeded and diced up, and then this is a holy moly pepper. <laughs> By the name, you'd think they're going to be really hot, but they're not. They're mildly spicy. I'm going to leave the seeds in and everything, and we're going to get that cut up, and super excited to have fresh garden vegetables at my fingertips now. I have my first tomato turning red. Um, I've really taken all the precautions that I possibly can to get my plants the best start this year. And if you like gardening, you can go check out the links that'll be in that upper right-hand corner. Uh, I've got links to some of those garden videos since this is a garden salsa. All right, I think that's all I'm gonna put in now. So one mango, two Roma tomatoes that were really ripe, nice and ripe, a half of a white onion, uh, maybe a, two tablespoons of cilantro chopped up, um, a garlic clove, one mango, and a couple peppers. So you could vary this. I also put a tablespoon of red wine vinegar and a drizzle of olive oil. And that's going to help this just become delicious and melt together in the refrigerator while we get So I'm back to my trout. I've got my grill started and I'm using the big green egg as you saw in the title. And I've got some hickory wood chunks on there. We're going to let it get heated up. I'm going to do it on the grill. Just a, a I mean, fish is the original fast food, and we're going to have this delicious fish. I'm excited. So what I'm going to do is I've got some extra virgin olive oil and just a drizzle on the inside, a little bit on the outside, just to let some spices stick to it. More, the spices are going to be more on the inside than the outside, but I did uh, go ahead and scale both of these fish pretty messy procedure, but it makes it totally worthwhile. And then I've got some adobo seasoning here. And I'm gonna dust the inside of this and the outside with a little adobo. And the inside of this one, this one's pretty big. And then we'll take some of this uh, Diamond Dave's seasoning. This is a salt-free seasoning, but it's got a citrus note to it, so I think it's gonna be delicious. We've had it on other fish and it's fantastic. So, And then before I turn it over, I'm going to go ahead and stuff the insides of these with sliced lime that I've washed and 
different. They're just, when they heat up, they're going to infuse this fish. So there you go. Get some slices down all along the inside there. And turn this over. the other side, kind of repeat the process, again, paper towel here, pretty much just a drizzle, and get a little of Famous Dave's, really good salt-free seasoning, it's very nice, and a little more of the adobo seasoning. You could use any kind of seasoning you think will go along with that mango salsa, but I think this is going to be fantastic. So I've got two more I'm going to do. We're going to get them out on the grill. So my grill is up to 400 degrees, and that's perfect. That's exactly what I want because this is going to cook really fast. I want the skin to get crispy and delicious. And so I'm going to go ahead. I've got my vent to about halfway, uh, but I'm, I'm going to go ahead and close the daisy wheel leaf or the vent up here and leave the wheel wide open so it stays nice and hot and we get a good airflow all the way through. Um, about a half load of hard lump charcoal. Ah, it's beautiful. Now wait, this is going to be so good. So literally couldn't be easier. I'm just going to go ahead and pick this up like that down there. Let me bring you over and show you what I got. And oh, this is going to be fabulous. A little bit of smoke and the healthy and delicious meat. That looks absolutely fabulous. Can't wait. I'm going to shut okay, her down. So I'm bringing you back for um, the fish and this trout looks amazing. I know you, you can agree with that because it's crispy and uh, charred on the outside. The limes have had a chance to kind of break down. And we've got our salsa on the side and this is such a nice low carb meal. Now you can tear this flesh off without the skin or you can have the skin. It's totally up to you how you do it. I'm going to have some of this beautiful trout with, mm -hmm, with some of that salsa. Oh my gosh. And there you go. There's my first bite. Mm. Mm. Oh. oh, you guys, you've got to do this. It's such an easy meal and it's so nice and healthy and low carb absolutely fantastic i don't know who wouldn't love this for a nice summertime barbecue mm -hmm. mm. Mm. oh my gosh and that sweet and kind of spicy salsa is just fantastic with this so i hope it inspires you to come back next time <laughs> Excuse me eating. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> and mm. I hope you'll check out all the links I have. And if you like grilled food and salsa, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Share it on your Facebook page. And you know what? You can share this on any of the yeah, other social media. Come back next time for another delicious recipe. Mm. And I actually really like the crispy skin. Absolutely <laughs> amazing. So I hope you try it.